while well, working on a 3.3, trying to do a coolant flush, it's a 3.3 Dodge Grand Caravan or Plymouth Grand Caravan or something, Voyager. 3.3 uh, liter flex fuel block. I found that on the forums, nobody knows how to change the coolant flush and remove the drain plugs. They keep pointing to this Chilton manual reference or factory service manual reference that refers to freeze plugs. Well. The uh, drain plugs are on the block to get the coolant out, so you can flush out the water jackets in the block, and they're easy to get to. So I'll show you where they are. <coughs> they are here. And let's see if I can get a light on this. That between the oil filter and the starter, you'll see a 9 16th inch plug. In this case, I'm, I'm doing a timing cover and I had a bad engine mount, so the engine's actually jacked up right now. But <coughs> the, uh, the plug is right there. It's a 9 16th inch pipe thread. Uh, I don't know what the, actually the pipe thread itself is, but it's a 19th inch head. And I just loosen it up, and hopefully, uh, I don't get a mouthful of coolant. Ratchet with one hand while holding a phone with the other. Makes it for sloppiness for me. Let's see here. Now this may not drain at all because I kind of sucked out some of the fluid while I was doing the timing cover. But there is proof that there is indeed a water, water jacket drain plug on these engines. There it goes. Jeez, it's all over the place, of course. <laughs> So, so I can, here it is, it's draining out. Alright, it's gonna splash a little bit. Oh, so, what I have here is a, I use a, I have a big tub from an old ferret cage my daughter had. And I use, let's fix this up a little. I don't wanna get antifreeze on my phone. But that's the plug. Comes right out, nice and easy. Um, I usually put some either Teflon tape or RTV on them when I put them back in. I don't know if you need to do that. They're pipe thread, so you probably don't need to do that. But I've never failed from from doing that. You can see some gunky stuff on the tip. It's kind of messy. So if you want to take the, uh, if you want to flush your system properly. You run the water through and <clears throat> dump out all the coolant. And there it is with the slide that back, get under there again. I work on a stone driveway because I don't have a real roomy area for this car in my garage. But you can see the hole, and there it is. Now there's one on the flip side of the engine. Let's see if I can find that real quick. End. It's supposed to be underneath the exhaust manifold, and I'm seeing people say on the boards that this thing's impossible to get to. They're talking about freeze plugs, all kinds of stuff. I don't know what they're talking about. I've had no trouble on most engines finding the drain plugs. I'm sure there's some out there that don't have them, but they're pretty rare. My Mazda, in fact, my, my pickup truck, you pretty much half the drain. You have to do the drain plugs every time you change the fluids. So, let's see if I can find it here. Without getting dripped all over and ruining my phone. Oh, there it is. Uh, let's see. There's a freeze plug. The big circular thing is a freeze plug. And right below that is a bolt head sticking out. And that is the drain plug. Got some oil hanging on it. Because it's a Dodge and they leak. I think uh, this... Dodge uh, makes only things that leak. So anyway, that's the drain plug. So I can get a, let's see if I can point to it or something. I 
love these phone cameras, but you really can't. You have a hands-free situation, you know. Let's see. I'll point to it right there. That's it. I'm tapping it. I'm tapping it right now. So I'm gonna say this plug should be easy as I'll have to get to with a six-inch extension. Alright, now that's between this above the axle shaft on the transmission. Uh, right above the midpoint of the block. And if I look at it, I can get through pretty straight it's a pretty straight shot. That's it right there below the freeze plug. Freeze plug is a big round circular thingy dingy in the middle. And just below that is that I think. Oh, maybe not. Okay, there it is. The other freeze plug. Sorry, I'm looking at the phone and contortionist style here. Uh, what we got here is the freeze plug is in the center approximately, and the crappy looking drain plug, all crusty with oil, is about the 7 o'clock position. So that's an easy shot to get to from the back of the engine, right above the axle shaft. So I'll take that one off now, and I'm not going to videotape that because I'll ruin my phone. So. <clears throat> yeah, that's right, I said videotape. I guess I'm old. So, anyway, uh, uh, nice little setup actually. I've had much worse ones to get to than this. This is not bad at all. And, anyway, alright, well, I hope you enjoyed the video. Some, at least you get some real answers instead of this crap where, oh, we don't have one. Oh, I just fill it up and we're going to walk through it. That's bullshit. Alright. Done.